welcome back to the channel and as you can see right now we are playing the one block a sky block for minecraft if you want to learn how to play this world in minecraft 1.20.6 make sure to watch this video until the end and let's go ahead and get started now the first step to get the one block a sky block for minecraft is to click on the second link in the description which is going to bring you to a written guide on how to download and install the one block sky block once over here scroll down and click on download on step one feel free to read through the guide but if you just want to follow along click on download that'll bring you over here where you're going to scroll down and you're going to look for 1.20.6 now as of right now it says 1.20.4 for the most recent version of the one block sky block however don't worry because this will work with minecraft 1.20.6 so let's just go ahead and download this by clicking on these little three dots and then download file and after five seconds our download will begin downloading the one block is completely safe just like it is completely safe to use our sponsor apex hosting if you're looking for a minecraft server either a java or a bedrock server that you could have open 24 7 so your friends could join at any moment and hear this you could even do a one block sky block server so if you're trying to play the map that we just downloaded with friends apex hosting is a perfect service for you they have locations all over the world and they will actually give you 25% off if you use the first link in the description. This server is hosted online so you don't have to port forward your IP address or use your computer resources to host the server. Let Apex Hosting do everything for you. Use the first link in the description and let's get back into the tutorial. Now that we downloaded the one block sky block let's go ahead and drag and drop it into our desktop. You should probably find this file in your downloads folder or within your recent downloads in your browser. This is going to be a zip file but don't worry because later on we're gonna fix this. Go ahead and open your Minecraft launcher. With your Minecraft launcher now open I want you to head over to Java Edition and then head over to installations. Once in here, find your latest release of Java and then click on this little folder that appears right next to the play button. That is going to open a folder with a lot of files. All you're doing in here is looking for another folder called saves. As you can see, I have the save folders in here. Go ahead and find that saves folder. And if you don't have it, you could always just right click, click new and then create a new folder and just name it save like that. And then go ahead and open that folder. In here, you should see all your worlds that you have ever created in Minecraft. What you're going to do next is open the zip file that we downloaded earlier, which is the one block sky block original. Just go ahead and open it. If you have Windows 11, you could just double click on it. And now go ahead and grab this folder in here, which you have all these files inside. Go ahead and grab this folder and drag and drop it into this saves folder. Okay, just drag and drop it into here, into an empty space. And that will add this folder, the one block sky block original folder into the saves folder. If you don't have Windows 11, then you should probably get something to unzip this file, something like WinRAR, or go ahead and try to unzip it using the default software that comes with Windows 10. But I'm also going to leave a guide in the description, a written article on how to download and install WinRAR in case you need to unzip this file. If you unzip this file, all you have to do is drag and drop the folder that we are dropping into here, just like we did once you unzip this file. But luckily for us, if you're using Windows 11, you could just open the zip file and drag and drop this folder into here. Let's wait for this to finish. Now that we finished adding the world into the save folder, we're going to go ahead and check to make sure we have everything right. Head over to the saves folder and find the one block original. Go ahead and open that folder and then you should see all these files in here. Now pay attention to this part because this is going to save a lot of trouble for some of you. If you open this folder, D1 block original, and instead of seeing all these files, you see another folder with the one block original name. Just go ahead and make sure to grab all the files within that folder and put them inside the first folder that you open when you go to saves and you find the one block original. Of course, you could rename this folder. I'm going to rename it one block sky block. Just go ahead and rename it if you want to. This is optional. But yeah, once you open saves and you open your one block sky block folder, you should see all these files in here, the player data, the data, data packs, all of that. If you see another folder and then you see these files, just go ahead and drag and drop these files out of that folder into the main folder. Once you've done that, you could go ahead and close this folder and you could even delete the zip file that we downloaded earlier. Go ahead and head back to your Minecraft launcher and launch Minecraft. You could launch your regular Minecraft or whichever version of Minecraft you're using in here, as long as it is above 1.20.4. In this case, we're going to use a 1.20.6 and I'm going to use Iris because I want to see the world with shaders. We have videos on the channel on how to install Iris in case you want to play Minecraft 1.20.6 using shaders. Within the game, let's just head over to single player because right now we're going to be using this world for a single player world. And let's look for that one block of sky block. As you can see, we have it right here, one block original. And I'm going to go ahead and launch it to prove to you guys that this is working in Minecraft 1.20.6. Like I said earlier, you could do this on a multiplayer server, especially if you have Apex Housing. And if you want to learn how to do that, just let me know down in the comments and I'll create a specific video for you guys to use this one block sky block world in a Minecraft server so you could play with friends. Anyways, as you can see, we're now here in the world and this is it. This is a one block sky block. Make sure to try and grab everything. You have to be really careful because things could fall. So as you're playing, just grab the things and yeah, you can now play 
the one block sky block for Minecraft. I hope this video was useful. If it was, let me know down in the comments. And before some people start complaining, yes, there is this barrier in this type of a sky block because this is the one block sky block original. If you want to play the version without any barriers, let me know down in comments and I'll probably make a dedicated video for that. But the reason I'm not doing it right now is because, because it is a bit outdated. If you're trying to play the version with no barriers, the latest update, it's kind of outdated. So I prefer to do this one, which is actually super recent. It's just 1.20.4. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a comment and subscribe. And as always, bye bye.